Taurus, welcome to your timeless angel spirit messages, love, finance, and career. If you're watching this, you are a Patreon tier two and three subscriber. Thank you so much for this monthly blessing gift that you contribute to. You make this possible. Angel spirits. Highest possible messages for Taurus at this time. This is a timeless reading, so whenever Taurus comes across this, to be applied, love, finance, and career, and also highest possible angel spirit messages for Taurus. We are dealing with the Six of Swords. Movement to a better place. Could be physically. Could be better communications. Better thinking. Logic. Reason. Text, email, typing, written, ideas, thinking, Paradise Island, sixes are all about moving to a better place. Could be physically, since this is in the upright. You could be taking a vacation, you could be relocating, you could be leaving a situation that just had nothing for you, Taurus. There's an eternity to do what you need to do, Taurus. Do not worry. You have the Ace of Wands in reverse. Aces are about new beginnings. So you may be trying to wrap up a cycle here coming off the back of the Six of Swords. A cycle due to lack of enthusiasm, lack of passion. This is why you're leaving. You lost the passion for it. You might just be going through the motions. You may have just been going through the motions for a long time, Taurus. You got the Two of Cups in reverse. This is contracts, agreements. In the reverse, you're no longer willing to do business in this way. You're no longer willing to do relationships in this way, Taurus. The situation had you outside of your strength. I see with the lion's head here on the two of cups in reverse. And therefore you wish to move on. Cancerian energy with the Two of Cups, Aquarius energy with the Six of Swords, Aries Leo Sagittarius energy with the Ace of Wands. These are some of the cast of characters that could be involved in your surroundings. Could be Sun or Moon sign. Spirit Angels, highest possible messages for Taurus finance, love, and career. Yeah, you are moving on emotionally as well. You've been out of it. You're looking for your new beginnings with the eight and this eight of cups. Moving on, Taurus. For the sake of emotional happiness and fulfillment. You're looking for reciprocity in health, wealth, luck, finances, career, maybe relationship with the two rings here on this pillow. This is the Angel Tarot, by the way. Six of Pentacles. Grace. Divine grace cures rage and pestilence. Absolves the guilty. So yeah, you may not have been free of guilt in this situation, Taurus. You might you might have been a leading role in this situation, Taurus. But you are absolved here. And you do deserve reciprocity in health, wealth, luck, finance, and career possibly a relationship you see the two rings on the pillow here this might be this whole coagulated amalgamation that is your life Taurus things aren't separate it's all one big ball of wax but you've deemed yourself worthy enough essentially now to move on to find that balance this in fact the six of pentacles is your card Okay, typically depicted as the emperor. Handing coins out to two individuals. Balance, reciprocity, could be from the universe. 
could be an actual high pain entity or force. This is the Taurus card though, the Six of Pentacles. Balance, stability. Six is the perfect number. And this is your card, Taurus. Again, the Hierophant. He's the advisor of the Emperor. Somebody may be seeing value in you. The Emperor gives coins to the two individuals outside of the church from the five, from the five of coins, which is also your energy. Somebody might be contracting you for work, for, for consultation or advisory work. There may be conflict. They may not like it. But you may be setting the pace, the tone, the requirements, the recommendations, the standards, the rules on how things should run. Could be spiritually inclined or involved, religiously inclined or involved as well. Again, this is about tradition. This is also the marriage card. Okay, and we have a duplicity a confirmation. We have rings on the pillow. The ring bearer. And we have the hair font. So, I mean, you could be leaving a marriage, Taurus. A marriage of sorts. It could be a marriage in finance or a marriage in, in actual love. You could have decided enough is enough. And now you're going to seek some universal truths of the self, Taurus. This is what the hermit does. This is Virgo energy. He goes inside to find the light within. And he does so by traveling the world. As above, so below, as within, so without. This is the old magician. And in doing so, you stand in your power as the king of pentacles. You learn something. You learn a thing or two from the emperor. Because the Aries and the Taurus share the king of pentacles obedience harmony peace calming of anger that's what this movement does for you taurus king of pentacles health wealth luck finances and the magician what do we say you're, you're striking out on your own in a way. You may be retrograding to some form of youthful exuberance that you may have felt that you needed to give up, sacrifice for something more traditional, Taurus. You might be having some sort of renaissance of self, Taurus. The magician is the young hermit. And this is an 11 card and this is a 1 card, so you might want to look up angel number 111. <clears throat> and you have temperance, divine timing, balance, purpose, the middle path. Purposeful. Reconciliation of self, I would think. Regains the favor of those one has offended. So you might be seeing the errors in your way. And you might be using this as a way to have some sort of renaissance of self. And carrying the lessons with you wherever you go. In your journey of creation and manifestation. And you have the star card. This is hopeful. Everything's coming up Millhouse, Taurus. The star is the wish granted after the tower moment. This is card number 17, which adds to an eight, which is new beginnings again, similar to the eight of cups. And the eight of cups plus the two of cups held in this Aquarian's hand is the 10 of cups. So you are really tuned in towards, you are really righteously on the right path. Please do apply this accordingly. If you have any hunches or insinuations of what the situation might pertain to, please do.
apply the spirit and the energy of this reading to that given situa situation in the hopes that the best and highest fulfilling possible outcome may occur for yourself and those around you, Taurus. Namaste. Light and love. Thank you, Taurus. Best of luck.